Welcome back. Please share, subscribe, and comment. Electric fields and forces answer. Certainly. Let's delve into electric fields and forces in physics. Electric fields. An electric field is a region around an electrically charged object or particle within which a force would be exerted on other charged objects or particles. The electric field at a point in space is defined as the force per unit charge that would be experienced by a small positive test charge placed at that point. That definition, electric fields, are vector quantities, meaning they have both magnitude and direction. They are defined at every point in space around a charged object. Origin. Electric fields arise from electric charges. A positive charge creates an outward electric field, while a negative charge creates an inward, towards the charge, electric field. Representation. Electric fields are represented by field lines that indicate the direction a positive test charge would move if placed in the field. Mathematical expression. For a point charge, the electric field at a distance from the charge is given by Coulomb's law. Whereas Coulomb's constant is the charge, is the distance from the charge, and is the unit vector pointing from the charge to the point where the field is measured. Electric forces. Electric forces arise due to the interaction between electric charges. They can attract or repel charges depending on their polarity, positive or negative. Coulomb's law. The force between two point charges and separated by a distance is given by. Whereas Coulomb's constant and are the magnitudes of the charges is the distance between them and is the unit vector pointing from to. Nature. Electric forces obey the principle of superposition, meaning the total force on a charge due to multiple other charges is the vector sum of the forces exerted by each individual charge. Direction. Like electric fields, electric forces are vector quantities, meaning they have both magnitude and direction. They follow the direction of the electric field at the location of the charge. Relationship between electric fields and forces. The electric field at a point due to a charge determines the force that would be exerted on a test charge placed at that point. Electric fields and forces are intimately related through the charge distribution in space. The field provides a way to understand how charges interact without needing to consider the presence of test charges explicitly. In summary, electric fields describe the influence that a charge exerts on its surroundings, while electric forces describe the interaction between charges themselves. Together, they form the basis of electrostatics, explaining phenomena such as attraction, repulsion, and the behavior of conductors and insulators.